To gain better knowledge of the entire process, we will explore steps three through six in more detail. After uh, he gets the green squares and, and, and boards um, and cuts the uh, boards into squares, then the drying process starts and it's done with on-site kilns. When the wood's moisture content changes, it causes the cell walls to expand with moisture gain or contract with moisture loss. When this happens, the finished drumstick can warp and go out of round. As the moisture content changes, uh, you know, in the wood, the cells actually move in the wood. And that's what causes the, the stick to warp. If the wood is not kiln dried correctly, it can lead to stress in the wood, which is pent up force caused by uneven moisture content. When stress bound wood is cut, the forces are unbalanced, causing the square, dowel, or stick to bow. The kiln and the fans and the drying process uh, and how the length of time that it takes to, to do that is, uh, is really important because if, if it wasn't done the way they do it, the sticks wouldn't be straight. And I think that the investments that the company has made to make our sticks, you can feel it right when you pick up the stick. It is, it's just obvious that these sticks are better than everything else out there. They actually built their own kilns to make sure that the drying process is done correctly and those sticks come out the way they're supposed to come out. Vic has wood scientists who know how to work with the properties of wood as opposed to against them. You're kind of like a wood, wood urgist, but a wood specialist who checks the moisture of the, that batch that's in the kilns. The idea is to use their knowledge to work with the wood, not against it. So we got to walk into the kilns today and I was in there for, you know, the half a minute and, and it's like a sauna, you know, it's like a sauna that is just this heated room that is drying out the wood at a very controlled, you know, with a very controlled process. So most kilns are designed to get the wood in and out as quick as possible for profit. But Vic's kilns are designed to minimize the stress on the wood and control the consistency and the moisture content. This is a process and a recipe that they came up with their own that has fine-tuned this process and made the quality even better. And they've discovered this through years of experimentation. Most kilns are set up to produce various wood products where the stress is not a top priority. With drumsticks, however, this is of the utmost importance. When that wood comes in, you wouldn't be in control of getting it right. Buying wood from a third party doesn't guarantee the perfection that Vic Firth requires. They've spoken with commercial kiln companies and determined that they wouldn't want to leave something as important uh, up to a third party, and therefore they've invested in their own on-site kilns. I would say there are four main points to our success. Number one, we strive to maintain the highest quality humanly possible. Number two, we are always creating innovative and imaginative products. Number three, we deliver the product within 24 to 48 hours. We guarantee the product to be what we say it is. I tried everything that was out there um, and I always, you know, returned back to Vic because they just felt better, they were more reliable. I've always felt that whatever the challenges were, I could meet them and do better. I like to work with people that pay attention to detail, that are the best at what they do, and that are reliable and, and competent at what they do. Whatever I accomplish and whatever I do, I always set standards for myself that are extremely high. That's why I'm with Vic.